in the Heart of the Word, Reflections by Father Joseph Mary, SCTJM, on the Daily Readings from the Holy Mass, Wednesday of the 25th week of Ordinary Time, Memorial of St. Vincent de Paul, Priest. God bless you, dear family. Today in the Heart of the Word, Jesus summons the Twelve and gives them power and authority over all demons and to cure diseases. He sends them to proclaim the kingdom of God and to heal the sick. Then he says to them, take nothing with you for the journey. My brothers and sisters, how will the disciples fulfill their mission to heal the sick and to exercise demons if they take nothing with them? According to Cardinal Joseph Ratzinger, Pope Benedict XVI, this nothing is the recognition of the powerlessness of human authority and the reception of the power of the divine authority of Christ in the sacraments of holy orders. Through holy orders, Jesus gives to the ordained a participation in his own ministerial priesthood, power, and authority. For this reason, the priestly blessing of persons, places, or sacred things is a holy protection from unclean spirits. Using holy water and exercise salt are a spiritual protection to our homes. Above all, Jesus shares his healing authority in the sacraments, among which the sacrament of reconciliation and the anointing of the sick are called the sacraments of healing, since their proper object is respectively the forgiveness of sins and giving strength and comfort to the infirm. My brothers and sisters, just as Jesus called his apostles in Galilee, today as we remember the life of St. Vincent de Paul, who had a very particular love for the poor, the sick, and the priesthood, let us ask the Lord to send many holy priests to cast out demons, to heal the sick, and to proclaim the kingdom of God. Let us listen to these words of Mother Adela. The kingdom of the love of Jesus has no precedence. It is the very love of God for man, the same love by which Jesus heals and elevates the human person in the sacraments. All for the heart of Jesus, through the heart of Mary.